Welcome to Manchester United News Channel, your daily source for exclusive updates on the club. Subscribe now and stay one step ahead with the latest information about Manchester United. Don't waste any time, click the subscribe button and stay updated on everything happening with our club. Let's get to the news. Raheem Sterling and Jadon Sancho are on the verge of a dramatic transfer swap, potentially changing the course of their careers as they seek new beginnings. Both players have found themselves marginalised at their current clubs, Sterling at Chelsea and Sancho at Manchester United, and are eager to reignite their footballing fortunes. Manchester United is reportedly keen on securing Raheem Sterling as their marquee summer acquisition. Sterling's recent exclusion from Chelsea's squad has left him looking for a fresh start, and United might just be the answer. However, the deal comes with a twist, United is considering sending Jade and Sancho the other way as part of the transaction, but they are keen on dictating the terms. Sterling's situation at Chelsea has been dire, he has yet to feature for the team this season, while Sancho's only recent action for Manchester United has been limited to a brief appearance during the Community Shield. With both players desperate to re-establish themselves, especially after missing out on Euro 2024, the clubs are exploring a swap deal. Recent reports suggest that Chelsea and Manchester United engaged in talks about this intriguing swap on Tuesday. The proposed deal would see Sancho and Sterling exchanging places with no cash involved, an ironic twist considering the financial aspects usually tied to such transfers. Moreover, Chelsea might have to cover a portion of Sterling's hefty £300,000 weekly wages, an amount hard to match elsewhere in Europe. Sterling is reportedly not keen on a move to Saudi Arabia, though another unnamed European club has shown interest. As discussions continue, there's no clear indication if United would demand a fee for Sancho, or if this would be one of the rare straight-swap deals. Chelsea is reportedly leaning towards a permanent transfer for Sterling rather than a loan. 442 suggests this swap could be a pragmatic solution to two tricky situations. United desperately needs attacking reinforcements, and Sancho's fallout with Eric Ten Hag and subsequent loan to Borussia Dortmund has made it evident he is no longer in the manager's plans. Sterling finds himself in a similar predicament and might be willing to join a club known for its fierce rivalries, having faced criticism from Liverpool fans after his move to Manchester City. The worst-case scenario for both clubs is that the players continue their lacklustre performances that made them expendable in the first place. However, with minimal financial risk beyond covering part of Sterling's wages, the potential rewards could outweigh the gamble. Both Sterling and Sancho are eager for a fresh start, and the potential change could also offer a clean slate on the international stage with Gareth Southgate's departure from the England setup. Before we proceed, subscribe to our channel and enable notifications to receive all the exclusive news about Manchester United. Don't miss any detail about your favourite team. It's extremely important for Manchester United fans. In a move that has stunned football fans across Europe, Jadon Sancho's tenure at Manchester United has come to a dramatic end. The once promising star, who was signed with great fanfare for £73 million from Borussia Dortmund in 2021, is now making headlines for his unexpected departure. As Sancho embarks on a new chapter with a return to his former club Borussia Dortmund, the circumstances surrounding his exit from Old Trafford are both intriguing and laden with controversy. Sancho's journey at Manchester United began with high expectations. After a stellar stint at Dortmund, where he was a key player and top scorer in the DFB Pokal, Sancho's arrival was anticipated to bolster United's attacking options. Early moments, including his debut goal against Villarreal and a Premier League strike against Chelsea, suggested that he might be the missing piece for the Red Devils. However, recent events have painted a different picture, highlighting a turbulent period marked by disciplinary issues and public spats with management. The turning point came in September 2023, when manager Eric Ten Hag's decision to exclude Sancho from the squad against Arsenal sparked a public dispute. Sancho's defence of his training performances on social media, followed by United's announcement of his disciplinary leave, revealed a fractured relationship between the player and the club. This discord ultimately set the stage for his departure, as Sancho's future at Manchester United became increasingly uncertain. On January 11, 2024, the deal was finalised, Sancho was loaned back to Borussia Dortmund for the remainder of the season. 
the move came amid growing tension and a clear desire from Sancho to continue his career away from Manchester. Dortmund, paying a reported for million euro loan fee, welcomed their former star with open arms. Since rejoining, Sancho has quickly made an impact, including a crucial assist in his first game back and impressive performances in the Champions League. Jadon Sancho's personality is as multifaceted as his footballing skills, often reflecting a blend of confidence, resilience, and a touch of rebelliousness. Known for his flair and creativity on the pitch, Sancho has also shown a strong sense of self-assuredness off it. This confidence, while a significant asset, has sometimes translated into challenges, particularly when dealing with high-pressure situations and public scrutiny. His outspoken nature, evident in his social media responses to criticism, highlights his unwillingness to shy away from defending himself, even if it places him in the crosshairs of controversy. Despite the recent turbulence at Manchester United, Sancho's resilience has been a defining feature of his career. His ability to rebound from setbacks, whether from injuries or dips in form, showcases a mental toughness that is crucial for any elite athlete. This resilience was particularly evident during his time at Borussia Dortmund, where he thrived despite the pressure of being one of the team's standout players. His determination to prove himself, especially during his lone return to Dortmund, underscores his commitment to overcoming challenges and regaining his top form. Sancho's charisma and positive energy have also made him a popular figure among teammates and fans. His playful demeanor and approachable nature contribute to a likable personality that resonates well within team environments. This aspect of his character is crucial in maintaining team morale and fostering a positive atmosphere, traits that were likely appreciated during his successful spells at both Dortmund and in the England youth setups. However, his recent struggles suggest that balancing this public persona with personal and professional expectations can be challenging. In sum, Jade and Sancho's personality is a complex mix of confidence, resilience, charisma, and a certain rebellious spirit. These traits have both fueled his rise to prominence and contributed to the difficulties he has faced in recent times. As he continues his career, understanding and managing these aspects of his personality will be crucial for navigating the highs and lows of professional football and achieving long-term success. As Sancho prepares for his Champions League final with Dortmund, the question remains, what's next for his career and Manchester United? The winger's departure marks a significant chapter in both his career and the club's ongoing quest to find stability and success. While Sancho's return to Dortmund might rekindle his form, Manchester United will be left to ponder the impact of his exit on their squad and future ambitions. The unfolding drama of Sancho's career promises to keep fans and analysts alike on edge, eager to see how this story will ultimately be resolved. Hey there, supporter! Don't forget to leave your like and subscribe to the channel, as it means a lot to Manchester United. Also, share your opinion about the news in the comments below. See you in the next video.